Welcome back everyone! Welcome back to Let's Play Train Mechanics Simulator 2017. We're still uh, working on steam engines and we're taking a new order right now. A steam locomotive needs a routine inspection to be able to continue driving. Check the condition on the brake system and the suspension. If necessary, make the necessary repairs. Um, it's quite interesting how many steam locomotives are in the city, like I said last time. Check the condition of the brake system and the suspension. Um, you know, it's like routine inspection <laughs> uh, for something that uh, is not even in real service anymore. But I'm not complaining because working on these is quite fun and a little bit different than the, uh, you know, the diesel electrics and the electric so this was the suspension and the brakes need to come off oh i can just take them off i thought i would need to take off the the other stuff um those connecting brake line things all right well let's uh, let's take that off no come on i see on this side there is the brake caliper connector why is it not on the other side that's so weird Okay, I need to take uh, that off first, the brake lever. Now I can take that off and the brake calipers. It's really quite interesting. Maybe they forgot about it on the other side, I'm not sure. Right, this is all mechanical. Wait, the rear axle springs are not? Brake caliper, quite expensive. Uh, brake caliper, 1400. Brake lever is fine. There's another brake caliper and another one then. Wow, they're getting more and more expensive. Look, this one is 1700. That was in very bad condition. I'm assuming the spring leaves will be electrical. Yes, they will be. Alright, 100% to repair them though. Chance, I mean. That's nice. There we go. It's gonna be all nice and shiny when we put it back together. So, installation mode. That one goes here. This side does not need the uh, brake line thingy, majig. This other side does, however. But first I need to put the brake calipers on. There's that one. And now I can put the brake caliper connector on and the con control arm. Oh no, brake lever. There we go. And that's not it yet. <laughs> Because there's stuff on the other side probably missing. What am I... What have I made? Oh yeah, wait a second. The suspension, obviously. There we go. I know I always say nice and shiny, but look. It is nice and shiny. Look at it. Brilliant. Alright, this is the last part here. Yeah, it's kind of a shame that you don't have to take this off and then the springs themselves, you know? Maybe a little bit more uh, complexity, but I'm fine with it, as is. Finish order! Right, we're getting... 1,000. Not much, but... It's nice for a short job. What is the next job? We received a report about a locomotive that had a problem with stopping, probably because of a faulty brake system. For safety reasons, the locomotive cannot drive to the repair station itself. Go there and tow it to the workshop. Well, why not? I mean, we can put some cushions here at the at the back or something. It can just go poof. You know, that's a completely acceptable and safe method of stopping a huge, heavy locomotive. Suburban station. That is here. No, that's the good station. Uh, diesel engine. Suburban station there. Uh, so we can just go over here. I think it's going to be the fastest. Yep, left, left, left. Wait, what's what's over there? What? What's going on here? Let's go and check it out. Oh, it's there? But it said the suburban station. Hey, I'm fine with it being right there, but that was weird. Alright, let's go back to the to the station. I mean, the train depot. That was weird. Interesting. It just occurred to me that um, we barely use this crane anymore now. Oh well. 
Oh, you can see inside the uh, locomotive. Right. So it's going to be just the brakes with this one. Just like before. Yep. Brake calipers. It appears that the control system of the brake system is damaged. Find the cause and repair the problem. Check if the brake calipers require replacement. We know they do. But now... Whoa! Bleh. Watch your speed. More like watch your step. Let's see. I have to look away. Uh, no, I don't think anyone... Anything is damaged there. Right, let's take these things off. There. Now the other side will need to have this taken off. Yeah, look, the other side does have the brake caliper connector thingy. But doesn't need it removed first. That's interesting. This cannot be all. Yeah. Look, control system of the brakes. Interesting. Now where will that be? It should be up here, right? Well, let me just check. I'm not familiar with steam engines that much. So it must be up here. Yeah, look at it. Brake lever. All that needs to come. Oh yeah, look at that. All that needs to come up. So this is cool. We're actually working on the uh, controls now. Pressure pipes. Pressure gauge hoses. Wow. No, this is fine. Oh yeah, I think we found it all, yeah. So let's go... Ah! Alright. Let's go and repair it. Underneath the train. <clears throat> well, that's in pretty bad condition. But shall be repaired. I need drink, excuse me. Ah. Brick caliper. And the brake... Whoa! What the hell is this brake lever made of? Gold? It's bloody 2,000. It doesn't have any moving parts, it's just a lever. That is quite bizarre. There's the brake assembly. Ooh, 66%. Um, hmm. I might actually upgrade my hydraulics bench. <clears throat> Let's do that. Wow, look at that. We, can ac we actually have enough money to improve it even further. Yeah, it's still 66. You know what? Improve it. Boop! There we go, fully improved. It should be... Wait, still 66%. I hate you all. Forever and ever. So I guess it just... I, I wasn't paying attention. I guess it just uh, lowers the price. Oh, well. Brake control system as well. And that's it. Alright. Let's go back and put it back together. So the brake calipers can come back on. There's one here as well. <clears throat> Then this one, and then we can put the connectors back together there. Alright, now we can go back to the uh, cab and put the brake system back together. Look at how nice and shiny that is. Yes, I always say that. Wow, that lever was expensive. There's the lovely copper pipes. Or no, they're not brass, they're copper, probably. Uh, there. And that's all. Yep, there it is. We're well within the budget. That's nice. Bye, train. Have a good one. Wow, we made actually quite a lot of money on that one. That was interesting. What was the next job, Bob? We received a report from... Cow herders caring for cattle by the river about a steam train that derailed near the pasture. There we go, talking about never using the crane anymore. Locate it and tow it to the repair workshop. Wow, okay. So, uh, good job, cow herder... Uh, cow herd carers. Uh, by the river, near the electric engine depot. Really? Um... Oh wait, that's here. There's the pasture. We go left, and then right, there. Oh no, wait a second, would it be better just going left? Would it be faster, I think, going through the oil, fi uh, oil fields? 
What's going on with my English? I'm going to horn. Just because, you know, I can. Yeah, the... The trains are nicely detailed. Well, for a, as a bonus, the wheels are actually turning, because a lot of the times in some games like these, you can, you know, they can kind of cheat and uh, not make the wheels turn and such. <clears throat> oh, look! If I go back and forth, there's even a Doppler effect. Slightly, but that's nice. Oh, it's on that side. Okay. Oh, the cows are going... Moo. Hey, cows! <laughs> Alright, there we go. How are you, cows? Oh, they don't want to look at me. They just want to eat grass. How rude. Oh, yeah, wait. Wait, wait, wait. I actually need to stop here. <laughs> I forgot the the, uh, the derailments. You actually have to stop. The game doesn't just, you know, provide you with, like, a portal. There we go. Press X to start crane mode. Um, haven't done this in a while now, so it's going to be interesting. <laughs> I can hear the cows. Uh, it would be nice to see the... Oh, there it is. C. Uh, height. There we go. We'll need to rotate the train a little bit. Let's also rotate the camera. Need to move it a little bit further. There we go. And rotate the actual train a little bit. There we go. A little bit too much. No, no, not that way. What am I doing? go. Let's uh, drop it down now. I think we need to move it a little bit. Yep. There we go. Alright. Now we can just go pedal to the metal. Back to the steam locomotive depot. Yep. Don't need to change any, uh, any of the tracks. Because we're going straight for home back whence we came. <clears throat> Horn, map, camera, braking, rotating the camera, increase engine power, decrease engine power. Where's the rockets and machine guns? I'm pretty sure uh, locomotives have to be equipped with those, you know, just in case. What's this? Uh, oh, was it like a speed limit or something? I don't know. Not sure... Uh, trains actually get speed limit signs like that. Yeah, right there. Trains are coming. <clears throat> so what did they say was wrong with this train? Not sure. Oh no, wait. They didn't say there was anything wrong. It, it just derailed. That was it. Alright, we're almost there. I remember not to uh, press the horn now. Cause I'm smart. Okay. Well, I can see that the connecting things are broken. Ooh, find the rail. Uh, the damages are relatively serious. Some wheel connectors and rods need to be replaced. Some of the springs have been damaged. And check if any of the drive wheel axles require repair. Quite um, a large repair, this one. This needs to come off. Not on the other side, though. There we go. Uh, the control stuff is okay there. See, these connectors are not, however. So let's take these off. Oops. No. Oh, I need to take this off first. Okay. There. Also, the uh, these things, the leaf springs are all bad. They're bad. Oh, everything came off. 
Oh wait, this just moved away a little bit. That was interesting. Okay, that's on the other side. The drive wheel axle will also need to go. Because it's rusty and not right. Wait, why am I doing this? I could have just done, done it from that side. That was weird. Alright, so the connectors... There. And now I need to get to the wheels here. Oh, yeah. Bloop, bloop, bloop. Come on. Please go there. Alright, don't then. The calipers come off, the wheel comes off, and now the leaf spring. I believe... Oh, yeah. The drive wheel axle. I believe that should be it. Yep, it is. Excellent. What's the budget on this one? Wait. Oh. Almost 1,600. I mean, 16,000, not 1,600. That would be a little bit... well, little. Right, that gets repaired. The wheel connector. And the other wheel connector as well. Shouldn't there be more? There's the leaf spring. And the other leaf spring. Can I... only this workbench. Oh, okay. Well, actually, that makes sense. And repair the other wheel connectors, because there's more. This is going to eat into our budget quickly, but I think we'll be fine. Yeah, see, these leaf, leaf springs are only 500-ish. Uh, right, let's check the hydraulics. I don't think there's anything in hydraulics. Nope. Should be stuff in electrics, though, because, well... Wow, the other leaf spring was repaired there. This one is repaired here. That was... Funny. Alright. It's all done and repaired. So we can put it back together. Gonna be lovely. Leaf springs? What? No, no, no. What, what's going on? I don't want to sell stuff. Wait. What's, that was weird. Okay, I think I was clicking a little bit too quickly there. No screws required though. It's like Lego. So these wheel connectors come on, also the brake calipers I can put back on, and the leaf springs on the other side. Over there, also the large wheels on the other side. Uh, there. Can I put the leaf spring? No. Because it's... because I actually can't see it. I can put the wheel connectors on the other side from here, though. There. Also, this connector, and the brake line thingy. And then this part, the brake lever. Alright, this side is not done yet. So it needs the big connecting rod. Now it's done, I believe. Okay, the small connector comes on here. The brake calipers. The big connecting rod. Look at how nicely we've repaired this... Uh, the steam engine here. Oh yeah, there's a... Uh, one of these is missing. There we go. Boop! And of course, screw it in. And that should be it. It is! And we're well within the budget. I am happy about that. And I need a drink. Hmm. So. We'll be finishing this part over here. I thank you, as always, very much for watching, and we're going to continue next time. Bye-bye.